All right, that's a wrap on firm and bronze breeding. She should be bred and we'll just watch in 21 days to see if she comes back into heat or not. But that is a breeding I'm really excited to see is fern and brawn. Fern has our best udder, our largest teats, our most milk production. And so I'm just really excited to see some does from her. The last one we have left to breed is Mavis. And she'll be with Smokey and that'll be it for our breeding season. So she should be up next to be bred. Just watching her to see when she comes into heat and then we'll put her with Smokey. Walk me in the morning sun Tell me I'm a lucky one I'm Riding on the wave Of an ocean that I could be brave Is there anything good on the radio? Turn it up loud and let me know How we used to be Before anyone heard of you and me Pretty exciting day. We're gonna get Pippi's ultrasound done. She's 56 days pregnant, and we have a person that's semi-local that has an ultrasound machine. So she's gonna come by, and we're gonna see how many babies are in there. We know she's pregnant for sure because she hasn't been back into heat. If she's just fat. <laughs> really upset. <laughs> <laughs> oh, honestly, probably. 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 I didn't see her go back into heat though. She she's hasn't been Pretty vocal. Oh, there I see something. There's one, I believe. That looks like one. One, two. There it is, wiggling right, right here. Mm -hmm. But over on the Right hand, every once in a while, you see the other one show up. Over here? See, right up there on the top, yep. Oh, right there. Right here. Right here. Two for sure then. All right guys, it's our second to last milk test on Fern. Second to last milk test on Fern and we're just trying to just barely squeeze by. So she's been bred and we got, uh, like I said, two milk tests left to go. So hopefully her production just holds on long enough to where she can get that star. Uh, I mean, <laughs> it's brutal. If we weren't on milk test, we probably would have stopped milking a long time ago. Um, I think one of the things that maybe we can learn from, from this experience is that we should have started a little bit earlier in the season. We started milking fern at, I wanna say about a month or two, maybe a month and a half in after she had kitted. And so if we had started a month, a month earlier, our, our milk test would shift uh, because their production is quite a bit when they first kid. And you know, that's it. That's every breeder's goal really is to, you know, breed the best goat that they can breed and produce the best dairy goat that's gonna win at the shows. Mm, that's what we want to do. We want to win the shows. <laughs> We're not there yet. We got a long ways to go. We're going to milk Fern for her second to last uh, milk test. Come on, Fern. That's cheating. Put your head in. No, 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 no. Put your head in the right way. There you go. Right. Excited to see how much production she'll have since we've been kind of monitoring it a little bit. We'll see. We'll see. Doesn't feel very full. You ready, Fern, for your test? <laughs> so Fern was bred on what day? October 2nd, and then she short cycled, so she went into heat again on October 7th. So she was rebred again on the 7th. So now we're gonna watch for a heat cycle in 21 days. If nothing happens, we're gonna assume she's pregnant and schedule an ultrasound. That's why we're not going to 
gonna get our all star. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, we're gonna be pretty close. It's gonna be borderline. Uh, like I said, if we would have started maybe a little earlier. Yeah, we started then, at 60 days. Yeah, so 60 days, that's two months basically. So we're, you could think that our production two months ago, she was still putting out two and a half pounds. So instead of putting point, <laughs> instead of putting point six pounds out right now in our test period, she'd be putting two and a half pounds out. And I have no doubt that if we would have started our testing a couple months earlier, then we would we would be miles ahead of where we're at now. Yeah, we're behind. We're yeah, we're behind a little bit. We're late late starters. But it was our first year, so we've learned a lot from this year. And I think next year we'll do it a little differently. So you just have to subscribe and stay tuned for how we do it next year. Look at that. That was a good pitch, huh? On today's episode of Pippi Don't Play, <laughs> see who Pippi's picking on in the meantime here. We got another bed. They really love these beds. So we got another one of those. Pippi. Pippi. She doesn't pick on Dottie. She thinks, yeah, she thinks Dottie's her baby. <laughs> Totally missed. Look at how much I got in there.